Gerald Burton Winrod was a Wichita, Kansas native nicknamed the Jayhawk Nazi and the Kansas Hitler. Winrod founded the Defenders of the Christian Faith, a fundamentalist Christian fascist organization. Winrod was a primary source of Wesley A. Swift's Christian identity doctrine, which William Branham would later rebrand as the Serpent Seed Doctrine, and appears to be the source of William Branham's position that President Roosevelt was a, quote, dictator that caused World War II. In the late 1940s and 1950s, Winrod's theology would become a theme in the latter reign and voice of healing revivals that would unite to form the post-World War II healing revival. Winrod was already a popular name among the Pentecostals, so much so that Amy Semple McPherson appointed Winrod as her replacement when she became too ill to continue preaching. Winrod's leadership of the Angelus Temple led to anti-Nazi protests and bomb threats. Interestingly, it was shortly after Winrod's engagement that William Branham's campaign manager, Gordon Lindsay, was appointed to field position work for the Angelus Temple. Gordon Lindsay toured Canada holding British-Israel conferences, helping to spread Winrod's agenda in the years leading up to the Healing Revival. William Branham, leader of the Healing Revival, convinced the masses that communism was invading the church in opposition to his brand of divine healing, and that as a result, Christian churches, those not in his cult following, had become apostate. Winrod frequently attacked the Federation of Churches, claiming that the group had rejected the virgin birth of Christ, both of which were also themes used in Branham's healing revivals. Winrod preached throughout the country in the late 1920s, in everything from conventions for the Christian and Missionary Alliance to small churches describing Mussolini's connection to the return of Christ and the end of days. You can learn this and more on william-branham.org.